What is up and welcome back to another DaVinci Resolve tutorial. My name is AJ Sharma. In this video, I'm gonna show you exactly how to fade in and fade out music in your video clips. In such a simple way, even your mum can do it. It's crazy. Okay, to get started, I've just added a cool forest clip alongside with a audio clip that I'd like to fade in and out. Now, before getting started, you need to um, just adjust the, the timeline view so you can see uh, more of the audio. So just hover over to this tab here, okay? And then click on it. It says timeline view options. Now go over to track height and then just adjust the track height just like so, so we can see it. Now you can play play with this like dropping the um, title or just putting it in the middle. It's up to you. We're just gonna go like this and now click off. Now there's multiple ways of fading audio in and out using DaVinci Resolve, but I'm gonna show you the first, the easiest way, and that is to simply hover over your audio clip until the white marker appears in the top left corner, just at the beginning of the track. As soon as you hovered over it, you'll see two arrows. Now simply click and drag this marker to fade in your audio. So we can, you know, put it over here. And then if we play it back, okay, maybe that's too short. So let's bring it over here and see what happens. Okay, that's much better. Now you can do this at the beginning or at the end of your audio clip to fade it in or out. So that works, but let's undo this and then show you another way. If you're loving this video so far, why not hit that subscribe button? Now position your cursor over the line of your audio track to where you want the fade to start. Let's say around here, okay? Then while holding the Alt key, on Windows or the Option key on Mac, click the line to start a starting keyframe. So there's one keyframe. Now move your cursor to the right where you want the audio to fade out by, and again, Alt or the Option key, uh, whichever you're using, click again to create a second keyframe. Okay, now we have two keyframes. Now just drag the second keyframe to where you want to get the audio out. And you can do the same thing with the first one. Okay, or you can go up. And you could do this with the beginning as well. So you can go down and then second keyframe, you expand. Okay, now using keyframes are so useful because they give you a little bit more control over the fade, and which is great. Now let's undo these keyframes. And I want to show you the last way to fade in and out your audio. So go ahead and go to your effects library on the top left. And under toolbox, we want to select audio transitions. And then let's grab the crossfade 0 dB and then simply drag it to the beginning of our audio clip. Now you can grab, uh, drag this to the beginning and end of your clip, and then drag another one to the end of your clip. Just like so. Now you can adjust the fade duration by simply dragging the end of the transition. Also, to get an easy crossfade via shortcut, you can select the audio clip on the timeline, like so, and press Control T on Windows or Command T on a Mac, and that's a quick shortcut. Now you have three ways to fade music in and out using DaVinci Resolve 17. There you have it. Three simple but very effective ways how to fade in and fade out music in your video clips. If you love this video, hit the thumbs up button and make sure you subscribe to my channel. I do many, many tutorials to help you become a better editor in DaVinci Resolve 17 and beyond. 
Make sure you check out my other videos on DaVinci Resolve, there are many tutorials, and I'm sure you're gonna love them. Until next time, guys, peace.